Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I'm coming at you guys with a really super fun haul video and in this video I'm going to be showing you a bunch of new pieces that were kindly sent to me by Ofer Body Jewelry. I have worked with them in the past and they are hands down one of my all-time favorite places to get body jewelry from and I love sharing these hauls with you guys and I love showing you all the new pieces because one they're absolutely gorgeous Two, they're really great quality. They have hundreds and hundreds of different pieces for all different kinds of piercings on their website and everything is just so beautiful. So just as a disclaimer, they did send me all of these pieces for free to show you guys in a video. I do also have a coupon code where you guys can use Brianne 30 to get 30% off of your order. It is not an affiliate code. I'm not making any money off of you guys using that code. It's just a code for you guys to get some money off and 30% off is a pretty dang good deal. So I will have that code and all of the information down in the description box. I will also have the links to every piece that I am about to show you down in the description box as well. My external mic for my camera did unfortunately take a crap on me so there is there may be a little more noticeable autofocus sound in this video. I'm gonna try to cut as much of that out as possible so you guys don't have to constantly hear the I'm gonna zoom you guys in so I can show you what all of the pieces look like. So the very first piece that I got, and this one, when I saw it on the site, I was dying for it. And it is a septum clicker. I do have my septum pierce, as you guys know. And I love septum clickers. I just think they're really easy, they're convenient. And this is a 16 gauge, 10 millimeter septum clicker. And as you can see, it is absolutely beautiful. It's kind of like, and I do not own anything like this at all. This is a kind of a triangle shaped and it has like the little gems and stuff right on the bottom. So here's what the septum clicker looks like out of the box and as you can see it is so sparkly and so beautiful. I have already put this one in and what I will say is I am Typically with my septum jewelry, I am a 16 gauge 10 millimeter for all of my septums, but for clickers, I feel like I need to go up to like 12 millimeters, especially for designs like this. This one still fits just fine and it, it's really secure and the click works really nice, but I feel like if I were to get this one again, I would definitely get a 12 millimeter just to have a little bit more wiggle room. If you guys do not know what a septum clicker is, basically it is like a little piece and it clicks open like this and you slide it into your nose and then the little clicky part just goes down and you click it. That's why it is called a septum clicker. I love this one so much. The next piece I got is kind of like a little earring moment. This would make a really good septum piercing as well, I feel. This is a 16 gauge, eight millimeter seamless ring. So as you can see, it is a really beautiful ring and it has five beautiful gems right in the center there. I got this one for the intention of being an earring. But if you wanted to wear this as a septum ring, you totally could. Could as well just like get a couple a couple millimeters up in size depending on what size your septum is here's what it looks like out of the box and oh my gosh it just sparkles and shines it is so incredibly beautiful. I just absolutely love how this one looks and I feel like this would make a really beautiful earring whether in like the tragus or a midway cartilage or anything of that sort. This would be really really flattering. It is very very similar to how a septum clicker works so it basically just pops open like that. You slide it into the piercing and then you just close this little bad boy back up. So kind of like maybe in like a little midway helix right here. The next earring I got Oh, bitch, this one, I love this one so much. So I really like this style of earring for, um, let's see, where is it, for conches right here. I love putting this kind of design in a conch piercing. I just feel like they're really elegant and really stylish looking. So this one is a 16 gauge. It is a flat back internally threaded earring. And here is what this beautiful gem looks like right here. Like I just love how ornate that looks. It just looks like a perfect little body ornament. This would be really good in like a flat helix or a conch 
or you know depending on what your anatomy looks like oh my gosh this would be stunning I don't know the exact length of the barbells for these they are a little bit long but it's not anything that like you know is detrimental or bad if you have really really thick ears or really really thick cartilage I feel like this length would work really good for you look how beautiful in ornate that is it's hard it's kind of hard to, it's really kind of cute because when you flip it like this it almost looks like a little itty bitty paw print the next two things I want to show you guys are belly rings and this is the body jewelry that I want to praise over for because I have had my belly button pierced for like 11 12 years now and I made a video not too long ago about how I was going to be taking out my belly ring and how I was talking about how I wasn't gonna wear my belly button piercing anymore and the only thing that really works in my belly button ring is really really short barbells and that is almost impossible to find in the body jewelry market at least in my experience but Ofer when I was looking on their site trying to pick pieces out oh my god they came to the rescue so this first pack this comes in a pack of 10 these are 14 gauge 6 millimeter belly button rings six millimeter meaning the length of the barbell and these work in my belly button piercing so good now i do have one of these in my belly button piercing already which i will show you guys there are 10 well minus one because i'm wearing one but there are 10 different belly button rings in here and they are all six millimeter so typically for my belly button piercing i wear either a 16 or a 14 gauge it really doesn't matter i can't honestly tell a difference either or but i was just like i almost cried because I can never find belly button rings that look like belly button rings that are short enough to fit in my anatomy you know what I mean here's what they look like out of the packaging and we just have so many different colors like we have like a iridescent one a gold a black rose gold your silver we have green pink i'm wearing the purple one right now we have red and blue all of these are externally threaded they're 14 gauge and they're six millimeter so if you guys have a belly button piercing that is like mine and the skin is really thin but it is still healthy and you want to get belly button jewelry that fits your anatomy Ofer is where it's at because these the length of these barbells as you can see very very short so it fits it's a lot shorter than your standard belly button ring, but they fit so much nicer and they just look so incredibly flattering in. So here is the ring that I currently have in. This is the silver with the purple balls. I don't know how well you can see the purple. It's more of like a lavender color, but as you can see, look how nicely it fits in my belly button. Like six millimeter is the perfect size for my belly button it just it looks like it's supposed to be there if I were to wear a belly button ring that had a really long post it would be flopping around all over the place I would be catching it on things but the six millimeter just fits really nicely and this is the tenth piece that comes in that ten piece pack that I just showed you and then I did get another little short belly button ring this one is a little bit more simple than the other ones but when I saw this one I just thought it was so beautiful this one is a 16 gauge so it's a little bit slimmer than the 14 gauge just really really simple it has that really sparkly bottom and then on the top it's just a plain little silver ball I love this one I believe this one is eight millimeters I'm pretty sure or six it's just the simplicity of this one I I don't know I just really liked it to some people this may be boring but to me it was just really like eye-catching and just really beautiful so I got this belly ring as well it's like so bright and shiny my camera is having a hard time like picking up just how beautiful this one is oh so maybe that's a little better just oh my gosh it's so sparkly oh my gosh I forgot I still have one more earring that I want to show you guys and then I'll show you all of the pieces that I currently have in my body right now this one is a 16 gauge flat back internally threaded earring and this style of earring is really kind of like coming about in like the style of jewelry and I can understand why because it's beautiful and Ofer has so many different options of this kind so 
If this style is something that you're into, definitely get your hands on this baby right here. And this piece I feel like would be really flattering in like a midway helix. And it is this beautiful earring right here. So it is a long jeweled bar and it is a flat back 16 gauge internally threaded. So perfect for earrings. And oh my gosh, do you see this? Just having this kind of like right here. It's so simple yet so eye-catching and beautiful. I'm absolutely obsessed with this style of earring that is going around right now. And they have gold, rose gold, silver like this one, titanium, all kinds of different really good quality things. For the internally threaded ones, it's actually really easy. You basically just untwist this part right here like that. And then this barbell slides into the ear from the back. And then you basically just twist this back on like so. Having some hemostats really do come in handy for jewelry like this. Absolutely stunning. And then all of the rest of the pieces that I really want to show you guys are currently on my in my ears and on my face. So the very first piece I want to show you is this little nose stud right here. So hopefully you guys can see that okay, but this little nose stud is a little tiny paw print. It has the little toe beans on the top and then right in the center is a really beautiful gem. It is so cute. So my line of work outside of YouTube revolves working with animals and I have dogs of my own. So when I saw this cute little paw print, I just thought that was absolutely perfect. It fits really well in my nose. I will go ahead and take it out and show you guys. A 20 or an 18 gauge, just little L-shaped nose stud. So they're really easy to put in like that and it's just a little itty bitty tiny paw print. This one is so cute and it just looks really flattering in the nose and it does lay perfectly flat so it doesn't like catch on anything. The second piece is another septum clicker and it is this one right here. This is of course another 16 gauge 10 millimeter little septum clicker and it has little gems and jewels all around here. So just like the first clicker that I showed you guys, it works just the same way. It has a little clicking mechanism that you pop in and out and it stays really nice and secure and I just love how like elegant this is. I have been searching for something like this for a very very long time and when I saw the Ofer had one I fell in love with it and I just had to have it. So here's what it looks like in the nose. Again 16 gauge 10 millimeter that's the diameter and it's just so beautiful and so flattering and I am obsessed with it. What do you guys think of it? I know this style is really simple but that is what I love, okay? I love the symbol. And then all of the rest of the pieces are in my ears. Some of them are really, really simple and you guys may not notice a difference in them. So we're gonna start on this ear right here. So the first one I'm sure you're probably noticing is this beautiful little gem right here. It is so eye-catching and so beautiful. And the thing that I like about this style of jewelry is it makes my ear look more full with piercings than it actually is. So it's kind of like this little sparkly gemmed leafy looking design and this is a 16 gauge internally threaded barbell there's kind of like what the back of it looks like right there it does spin around quite a bit because the bar is a little bit long but it doesn't like bother me or anything I still think it looks just as gorgeous so that is the one piece I have in here and then in my tragus I have two new hoops these are seamless 16 gauge, eight millimeter, or wait, no, I'm sorry, six millimeter, just little simple hoops. Again, I like simple and I like having hoops in my tragus. That's personally my favorite thing. So I did put in a little six millimeter, 16 gauge seamless hoop right in there. And that is everything new for this ear. And then for this ear, we have my favorite piece, which is this guy right up here. This is another 16 gauge internally threaded at back barbell. Can, I don't know if you guys can see. And this fits in this helix piercing so well. Sorry, I have some hair dye on my ears. Just try to ignore that. But this one just fits in this piercing so well and it looks so flattering and it fits perfectly. I don't have any issues with it. it oh my god, I'm a, this one's going to be in here for a very, very long time because it's just too striking. The other two new ones I have are in my forward helix. I have two, just like in my tragus, I have two 16 gauge 
eight millimeter seamless rings that go in my forward helix. I had something similar in there before, but they were a little too big. I asked them to send me just some eight millimeter ones, and as you can see, they fit really, really well. And then in this tragus, I have the identical ring that we have over on this side. So this is a 16 gauge, six millimeter seamless hoop. And then the very last piece is this guy right in my conch, which I don't know like the best way to show you. There we go. It is this, again, 16 gauge, internally threaded little barbell right here. And I don't know how well you will be able to see on camera, but it is these really beautiful, like geometric shapes. I just thought this one was kind of fun and different and I don't own anything like this. And they're just little like hexagons or little geometric shapes. And I just thought it was really cute in the conch, just kind of something different and fun. There's just kind of what it looks like from farther away. And yes, I know I have blackheads inside my ears. I have had them for years and I don't know how to get rid of them. Like, I'm sorry for being human. You guys have any tips on how to get rid of blackheads in the ears? I would greatly appreciate it because I hate them just as much as you do. <laughs> Alrighty guys, and those are all of the new pieces that I got from Ofer. What do you guys think of them? What is your personal favorite piece that you saw? I'm glad I got to show you what some of them look like in the ears and also what they look like when they come packaged. Again, the coupon code and the links for everything, including all of Ofer's social media will be down in the description box. I wanna give a huge thank you to Ofer for reaching out to me and for working with me and sending me all of these absolutely beautiful pieces. I'm so honored to be working with you guys. You have beautiful jewelry and I am absolutely obsessed with it. So thank you so much. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you go down and give a huge thumbs up. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. If you are new to my channel and you are a body jewelry fan like myself, make sure you go down and hit that red subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future content. But as the rest of you, I love you guys so very much. Thank you for watching and I will see you again very soon in my next video. I love you guys. Bye! Mwah.